All right, here are the, our audience here. Okay, let's start. Um, hi, today I'm going to introduce uh, you how to penny hamsters. Um, hamster, hamsters is uh, one, uh, one kind of the small animals that's really popular in the United States. Uh, and uh, there are actually 25 species like, uh, uh, in that family. But actually there are just like uh, five most uh, popular ones uh, on the market. Um, and they are the Syrian hamster, dwarf camel, uh, dog camel, uh, Russian hamster, dwarf winter white uh, Russian hamster, and the uh, Roborowski uh, dwarf hamster, and the Chinese hamsters. And first let me introduce the uh, Syrian hamster. Um, this is the biggest one in that family. It's uh, the adult size of it could be uh, grown to a four inch to a seven inch, and the lifespan of it is uh, two to uh, two and a half year. And because uh, they are not really social, so you better not like pair them together. Um, and uh, it also called golden or teddy bear hamster because it uh, usually comes uh, comes in um, golden color. But there's also a variety of colors of them like white, gray. And uh, they're really good for children because they're, uh, they're the, they got really big size and they don't move that much. So it's uh, really good for handling. Um, and next I'm uh, going to talk about the uh, Jeff Chamber Russian hamster. Um, this kind, they're really social. As you can see in the picture, they're uh, holding, t holding hands together or something. Uh, and uh, so you can pet them in the same cage. And they're pretty sensitive, so better not like just go, uh, straight touch them, they're going to get scared. And uh, the adult size of them is a little bit smaller, it's just about like 4 inch, and uh, the life, average lifespan of them is 2, two years. Um, and uh, and uh, actually the outside of the locking is they mostly just come in green, or like a dark brown, and uh, their uh, stomach size is like a white. And mostly on the face or back, they're just in the same color, dark or dark brown or uh, black. And the next, I'm going to talk about the dwarf winter white Russian hamster. Um, for this kind of hamster, it's like a pretty similar to the one I just talked about, the dwarf uh, chambel, dwarf hamster, or the Russian hamster. And uh, they're special because they're color. Um, this is a pure color, and there's another, like a sapphire color there. Uh, and uh, sometimes there's uh, have a mixed mixture uh, type coming out, and uh, they're really beautiful. That's why they're special. And uh, the the outside of them is uh, three to half, uh, three half to four inch, and uh, the lifespan is also about two years. And uh, also they're they're social like the normal dwarf hamsters. We can pet them together. And the next is uh, Robotsky dwarf hamster. They actually come, in, uh, come from uh, China or uh, East China or uh, Russian. And uh, they also call it robot hamster in you normal. And uh, actually they're really small. Like they, they can just go to like one half or like two inch. So you better just ob observation them instead of holding, handing them in your hand or something. And uh, the last one of them is pretty long. It, they're the, uh, their life is the longest through all the species. Uh, they can live for three to three and a half years, and sometimes they can be live like as long as four years. And uh, as you see, the, uh, the, uh, the outside of them, the figure of them, they're special because they have uh, like a, uh, some white fear just on, the uh, uh, on top of their, their eyes. So they're, so you can see they're special because of that. And uh, the color usually just brown on the back. And the last uh, last one is the Chinese hamsters. Um, they are also known as the striped hamsters, and uh, they are pretty social, like other small hamsters. And uh, they can grow uh, as large as like a four inch, and the left is uh, pretty short, sure, just one half or two years. Uh, and there it comes to in two colors, like a dark brown or a white on the back, and uh, white for the stomach side, and uh, they're different because their body size. Like other hamsters type there, sometimes you can see they're like a, just a ball, but these ones, they're pretty long, as you can see, and uh, uh, they're, I always say they're pretty much like mice instead of a hamster. 
And then I'm gonna talk about uh, how how we're gonna pad them. First, I'm, we're gonna talk about bedding. Um, bedding for them, you can use a lot of materials like tissue, paper, clothes, uh, pine, cotton. They all wanna work out. Um, they usually like to make them make their nest by themselves. So just put them this material in there or build build a bed something for them by themselves. And then uh, the food and water. Um, the hamsters like like other mice. They like seeds. They like nuts. They like vegetables, fruits, cheese, yogurt, and uh, raisins. They're, they're, that's the favorite snack for them. And uh, for the water, they don't drink water so much. So better if you just put some vegetables inside the fresh vegetables. That will give them enough water. And uh, last, most important one is exciting. Like hamsters really like working out. In, um, the only one don't like work out just the first one I'm talking about the serial hamster. That one's just like sleeping out there and it's active for a really short time. But uh, for other kinds of small, uh, small uh, hamster like dwarf hamster, Chinese hamsters, they like working out a lot. So you better have a running wheel for them to for exciting. Um, and uh, uh, well, uh, now through my speech, you may know like there, you should you should know there's like five really popular hamsters on the market, um, and uh, probably you you are planning to pet one, but uh, you need to know like if you pet them, you need to treat them like your kids. You need to take really good care of them, or they're just gonna die or something. So better take good care of them and uh, know how to take responsibility before you're doing that. And uh, let's pet those adorable creatures. Thank you.